grandma got ran over by a reindeer. Walking home from our house Christmas Eve. You can, you can say, say there's no such thing as Santa. And as for me and grandpa, we believe. She'd been, been drinking too much eggnog. And we begged her not to go. But she, she forgot, forgot her medication. medication. And she staggered, staggered out the door, door into the snow. Into the snow. Right now, grandma got run over by a reindeer. Walking home from our house for Sissy. You can say there's no such thing as Santa. As for me and Grandpa, we believe. Hey Miners, welcome to our holiday episode of Ed Hughes. Yes, I hope everyone had a great day so far. So, you're really sticking to this being nice thing, aren't you? Yeah, why wouldn't I? I don't want to get coal in my stocking. Right. Let's go to Megan with Miner Report. Attention seniors, the FAFSA application is available on January 1st at www.fafsa.ed.gov. Seniors, graduation services will be here one final time today at lunch in the library to place in your orders for cap and gowns. Also, seniors, the LDA Monte local scholarship application is now available in the student services office. The deadline is January 14th. Anime Club meeting today at lunch in room 358. Christian, do you ever wonder what it feels like to have girls come over to your house? Why would I think that? Wait a minute. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Okay. On the count of three, name what you're thinking. Alright. Right. One. Two. two. Milkshakes! Milkshakes! Mil milkshakes! Our milkshakes bring girls to the backyard and they're like, I want to drink yours, that's right. The best outdoors, I can beat you, but I have to charge. Our milkshakes bring girls to the backyard, and they're like, who wants to pour? I'm like, girl, it's all yours, I can teach you, but you could ask No, you want it? The thing that makes these, what the girls go crazy for. If you're unkind, back up the line, wait until your time. Nah, nah, nah. Milkshakes bring girls to the backyard and she's like Mine's better than yours, that's right It tastes better than yours, I can fight you But that'll upset mom You know, I just love watching movies Well, who doesn't? What's your favorite movie? The Wedding Singer, I love it You know, they're doing that for the school musical this year No way Yeah, let's find out more about it Hey guys, and thanks for coming to my seminar on how to become a wedding singer. Here you're going to find out everything you need to know about becoming a wedding singer. Now let me ask you guys some questions. Why do you want to become a wedding singer? Yes. I want girls. <laughs> exactly. There are lots of babes at weddings, and so this is a perfect thing to get into if you like babes. All right, why else do you want to become a wedding singer? Anybody? Yes, back here. Yeah, I totally want to be like a mega rock star, you know? I like the way you're thinking. This is a great stepping stone career to become a mega rock star. It will happen eventually. All right, anybody else, why do you want to become a wedding singer? 
Yes, sir. I think weddings are beautiful, and I want to be a part of that joy. Yeah, I'm not so sure you're in the right place, my friend. Moving on, uh, let's, let's continue. Um, what do you guys need to become a great wedding singer? Well, let me, no, that's not a question. I'm going to tell you. Here's a couple things that you need to become a good wedding singer. First, you got to know how to sing. If you can't sing, you're not going to be a good wedding singer. Number two, you got to know how to play the guitar. Guitar, singing. Some people think you need to be able to dance. Just last week, I saw this guy dancing with a globe. And guys, tell me, what do girls think of guys that dance with globes? Loser! Exactly, loser. Don't do that. It's all about guitar and singing. All right? Guys, I have a great opportunity for you to jumpstart your career as a wedding singer starting January 21st at the L.J. Williams Theater. The musical The Wedding Singer is playing. It's going to be a wonderful show. Very awesome. So guys, are we ready? Yeah. Yeah. I think. Then let's go get them. I'm so excited. I'm totally going to go see that. Me too. It should be great. I have a question. What was that thing at the end of the show on Wednesday? The undiscovered notebook thing? Yeah, that thing. Yeah, um, I think it's Ed Hughes sending a message to me. Man, I'm sorry I have to break this to you, but I don't think Ed Hughes exists. Well, let's watch and find out. Chapter one. The beginning. Empty your mind. Be formed. Shape it. Like water. Now you put water into a cup. It becomes the cup. You put water into a bottle, it becomes the bottle. You put it in a teapot, it becomes the teapot. Now water can flow or it can crash. Water, my friend. Help me up. Okay. Come on. Oh, dude. Oh. You're good. You're good. And you're there. How's it going, Theo? It's going good. Did you bring the notebook? Yeah, I brought it. Oh, okay. Yeah, hey, Theo, tell me what you were talking about earlier about the whole oh, like, yeah. traveling. Oh, yeah. Oh, dude, I gotta tell you. All right, so I'm headed to my grandma's. But I have to fly there. Dude, you can't fly there. You know what happened. Let me just tell you down here. All right, let's just go down. Okay, All so, right. I have to go to my grandma's this weekend. You're flying, right? Yeah. Why are you flying? Because I have to, there's no other way. Did you, not see the, did you not see the news about the lady that was in a bathing suit, and she didn't want to get frisked, so she just went through with the bathing suit? That's disgusting. Are you going to go in with the bathing suit? No. Then you want to get frisked, then? No. Then why are you going to go to the airport and go because through that? Because I have that? to go see my grandma's. Why Man. can't she come over here? <sighs> that sucks. Man. I wish I could fly like leaves. I know, honestly, a leaf would probably be better because, look, a leaf, it falls, it flies, it goes to its destination without having to get brisk. Just blows through ah. the wind, not a care in the world. But no, apparently now I have to get frisked. You know what? Instead of that, I can fly on a bird. How do you even fly on a bird? Well, do you get like a huge bird? You know what? How about I just take the train? Yeah, you should take it train. Dude, Theo, just take this right here. Okay, let me see. What? It doesn't work. Dude, Theo, let's just, let's just go. No, Come right. on. It's fine. So what are you going to get your grandma? Um, I think I'm going to get her a snow globe. Yeah, I'm going to get her a snow globe. Snow globe. Okay, that sounds fun for a grandma. Yeah. All right. That looks good, huh? Hi. Why can't you just give it to me now? Marcus, why do you have my grandma's number? I don't she, Come gave back here. she gave it to me, dude. You can't meet her, she's in Michigan. You're right, there is no message in that, but it was entertaining. Yeah, I can't wait to see more. 
Jackie, what if Ed Hughes never sends me another message? What if he thinks that I gave up? Well, if he thinks that you gave up, then he'd make it easier for you to find clues. He'd be careless and leave them around all the time. You're right. That actually makes complete sense. While you think about that, let's go to Brandon with Entertainment. Oh, wait, dude, come on. I don't want to take the math test. Oh, wow. Uh, embarrassing. Yeah, uh, sorry about that, LD. I've been up all night training for entertainment in 30 seconds, and today is the day I will pass. No ifs, no ands, and no buts about it. Be mature. And I even have my lucky shirt, so nothing bad is going to happen to me today. Nothing. Now, if you'd be as so kind to roll those movie clips. Yogi Bear, a bear that steals picnic baskets and annoys rangers. Enough said. Tron Legacy, a kid is sucked into a video game and must find its father. It's awesome. The Tourist, Angelina Jolie, Johnny Depp, lots of guns, and fighting. Enough said. Inception, it's confused it did me, but if you see I'm sure you'll like it. I don't know. Gulliver's Travels, Jack Black is a nobody until he turns into a really big, then he's a somebody. MC Hammer Concert at the Same Art Center, January 1st. Buy tickets now. A Christmas Carol, a great modern take on the Scrooge, perfect for the holidays. Narnia, like all the other Narnias without the wardrobe, of course. George Lopez is visiting Hanford. Be sure and get tickets today. A Christmas Story, a tradition in my household, a great holiday comedy. Look into it. Whoa! What now? I beat you, you dumb timer. Ha, take that. I'm the winner today. <sighs> Calm down. Now be sure and check out all the movies, concerts, and shows that I've mentioned. Yep, all 10. Well, I think that's all I have to say. Happy holidays, LD. Congratulations, Brandon, you finally passed. Yeah, that was great, Brandon. Don't be down. Maybe for your Christmas present, Ed Hughes will show himself to you. Yeah, that's true, Jackie. I don't know what I would do if you were still mean. What? I was never mean. Right, let's go to sports for Chris. Hey, how's it going, everybody? You can catch our winter sports in action up in Lemoore and Fresno today and tomorrow. The soccer program will kick it off as the boys will compete in the Lemoore tournament at 10, while the girls will play in the Hoover tournament in Fresno starting at 11.40. Following soccer, the wrestling team will be added again as they, too, will head up to Fresno to compete in the Chukchansi Invitational at 7. Well, that's all going down for now, so be sure to support your minor sports teams and I'll catch all you guys next year. Coco and Cram, Coco and Cram, Coco and Cram. All Link Code leaders must volunteer and sign up today in room 614 with Mr. Mendoza. Coco and Cookies, Coco and Cookies, Coco and Cookies, Coco and Cookies, Coco and Cookies. Jackie, this is our last show until next semester. What? Finals are next week? Yeah, I'm guessing you're not ready. Not at all. I don't even know the schedule for next week. Well, here is the schedule. I can't believe finals are next week. I'm not ready. I am. Of course you are. Well, good luck to you minors on your finals. Merry Christmas, Kwanzaa, and Hanukkah, and New Year's. Bye, minors. Let's go play this year. Look. For your Christmas present, Ed Hughes will show himself to you. <laughs> yeah. Three, two. Three, two. Oh, oh no! Good day. Now you be as now as you. Uh, uh.